A critical distinction that's going to help you play better is to understand the difference between tempo and rhythm. They are not the same. Let's get that clear. Tempo is the measure of time. Do you have a fast swing or a slow swing? Hideki Matsuyama, a very slow swing to the top. Graham McDowell, very quick. Tempo, T, tempo is time. Rhythm, ratio, is actually much more important. You hear the guys on tour talk about tempo. You know what? They really mean rhythm. So let me tell you what rhythm is. Rhythm is the ratio between how long it takes you to go from setup to the top, and then how long it takes you to go from top to the bottom. We have all sorts of technology these days that can measure it. And here's the thing, just about every player, regardless of tempo, their rhythm is a ratio of about three counts to one with the full swing. Now, how do you do that? It's easy. You just count 101, one. So the rhythm with a driver, no matter what your tempo, the rhythm is 101, one. That's the rhythm with the driver. Is it the same with a wedge and a putter, Martin? No, it's not the same with a wedge and a putter. It's a different rhythm. With the putter, the count is different. The putter count, 1001. Very different, 1001. If I'm putting, I want the rhythm, the ratio to be 1001. Irrespective of the length of the putt, three feet, 33 feet, 333 feet, the rhythm is 1001. The tempo, that's your choice. What about pitching? Well, that's somewhere in between, and that is one and two. So three different rhythms, pitching would be one and two. Three different rhythms, tempos can vary, so remember, tempo, T, is time. How long does it take? Rhythm actually is way more important. 101, one with the full swings, 1,001 with the putter, one and two with your pitching. That's going to help you play better.